What they have done is made our people functionally illiterate, making them unable to express their native and innate intelligence. That's how they rule. Here I am demonstrating Yahweh University. All the media wants to come and film our children, Yahweh University. <laughs> they want to, and then they ask me the question, how do you get them to learn what they learn? How do you do it? Because you're geniuses. And I say Yahweh. <laughs> it's the perfect moral teaching. See, I know when I say that, they're incapable of understanding what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. So they, they just keep asking the questions around how do, and all the time I'm telling them how, but they are incapable of receiving what I'm saying. They don't have enough intelligence to perceive what I'm telling them. They keep coming to interview me trying to learn my secrets. See, they admit in the interview that it's ironic that in the midst of the ghetto, I'm producing the opposite of the ghetto and producing a product superior to the rulership of America. They admit it. The question is, how do you do it? They admit that I'm accomplishing among the drug community, in the middle of the drug community, what they, with all their power, money, resources, guns, police, and everything, aren't able to accomplish. And they want to know how. What they really want to do is to try to pit me against my black brothers who deal in drugs and put us in a war state. And you're not going to be able to pull no Ethiopia here with me. <laughs> in Ethiopia, you got blacks killing blacks, man, you know, and killing their own people. Both sides are guilty. No, 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 no. No, see, my war is not against the black brother that's dealing drugs. I'm at war with the, with the sucker that owns the airplanes and the ships that bring it in. Mm. And teach my people that's all they can do. Mm -hmm. It's not my black brother that's afraid of what I'm doing. It's the one that owns the ships and owns the airplane and that sits on the judge's bench mm. and sits in a, in a, a, a government that's worried that I might drive their business up in the ghetto and the country will go broke and they'll lose their control. That's who I'm at war against. I want no, I'm not playing no game against my brother. That's where the Muslims have made a mistake. They going in on a battle war zone type thing. You know, no, man. It's not about beating your brother. It's about oh, treat the symptom. Jacob selling drugs is a symptom of the sickness. Let's get down with the cause. I'll show I know how to get after the cause. I don't have drugs here. I don't have drugs on my property. And my brother's dealing drugs. The dealer here understands that, really. He's demonstrating. He understands. They tell his brother, his boy, look, hang off of Yahweh's property. We respect Yahweh. We don't want to have to go to no... Well, if they that intelligence, how smart you think I am? <laughs>